your fourth time around this corner. You can't get it right. <gasps> what is going on, everybody? Welcome back today, guys, to the channel. Back here on some Wreckfest on the PC. I have been really anxious to get back on this game. And now, with my brand new Thrustmaster T248, uh, we're gonna be hopping into some online races for today. If you guys have not seen the first impressions episode of me actually unboxing this wheel, this really great entry model wheel, this wheel will be going on pre-sale on the 31st of August, so just a couple of days. If not, I do believe maybe tomorrow going out. So just make sure you guys mark your calendar, August 31st. And this does have about 70% more force feedback than the TMX. So I'm really excited here. This is the hybrid drive working on PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, and on the PC. Today is sponsored by Thrustmaster, so huge thank you for them supplying the wheel for today's episode. This thing is really cool having an opportunity to review this prior. Now, right now, I did try to get the LCD screen working. There's actually a lot of really cool modes that run real time with the games that you're playing. F1, for example, does have that going on. I do believe the race room experience, I do believe iRacing also has it, but today though, we are on Wreckfest, and from what I've tried, I don't see it compatible at the moment however though when it does get released to the public firmware updates upgrades and stuff like that so by the time that this does get released everything will be working so do not worry about that but today though we just have our panels on the lcd going up and down uh respectively so right this is gonna be a lot of fun for today huge thanks for watching we're gonna hop into some online and uh we're gonna test this wheel out and we're gonna also go up to 100 force feedback so we're gonna see what happens right now i don't believe thrustmaster has any official links out there for the t248 i will leave thrustmaster's official website down below make sure you guys do stay locked on that for the 31st of august get your pre-orders in if you're thinking about picking this thing up really excited for this for today huge thanks for watching and of course don't forget to slap that like button Okay, so my cars, what do I even have? Oh yeah, yeah, we got a couple cars out here. Multiplayer and let's go server browser. Let's see what's going on here. They're all packed. Look at how many lobbies there are going on, man. These things are packed at the moment. Okay, we're gonna join this one here. Yeah, 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 join, 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 join. No rules, any car, normal damage. Uh, now, of course, today, the whole kind of camera setup is temporary. If you guys do like it, let me know in the comment section down below. But we got the green screen set up. We got the wheel basically in the game. Man. And of course, before we start today, Quick sip of coffee, man. Let me know what you guys are sipping on down below. Mm-hmm. It's a little bit longer to load in. That's okay, though. I guess we're going main circuit fire rock. Yeah, I didn't even get a say in that one, man. They just chose it. Gloves on, yeah. First race here on Wreckfest. Oh, my God. What was that? What the hell, man? Oh, we're lagging. The server's a little bit laggy, seems like. Oh, my. Really? Okay, okay. Oh, my. Welcome to Wreckfest. How may we help you? Oh my goodness. This guy's right in my way. Yeah, no, come on. Oh, the charger just got wrecked. Straight T-bone. First impressions of this force feedback though. I'm liking this. It's actually quite smooth. I was expecting like the TMX to have the kind of the gear feel inside of it. But it feels very smooth inside. Oh boy, too much brake, too much brake. Right. Of course, with the T248, we have the T3 PM pedals. Brand new pedals. Oh, shit. These have been pretty cool as well, too. Okay, I'm going to go ahead. I want to see what force feedback rating I am on here. So I'm going to go into this, and we can actually see everything as we're driving. Oh, shit. Here we go. Drop that down to third. Sir, I don't want the ice cream. Okay, so we're on force feedback number three at the moment, and there is graphs that actually showcase the differences. Really? Now, the one thing that I never really mentioned was this wheel is 900 degree capable, so that is also really cool. So we've dropped it down to force feedback two, and in game I'm running a really low uh, two or I think 28 force feedback, I do believe. Oh shit! Drop, drop. Oh, crooms, man, get away! Big boost, big boost. Oh shit, you're done. Damn! Oh, we took out a lot on that one there. We're gonna go ahead and wreck this Rexy, unfortunately. Am I gonna do it? Oh no. Wow! That guy just wrecked himself. There we go. Oh shit. Oh, don't do that. Oh boy, this ice cream truck's definitely after me. Thankfully, he ain't, he ain't gonna get this now. Three to four laps. I gotta pay attention to where I'm going. Ooh, ow! Oh 
Oh shit, I should have seen that coming. I'll take this guy. Oh! We're good, we're good. Oh my god, I'm not good, I'm not good. Jeez. Let's bring up force feedback actually in the game here. Let's see what happens. We're gonna go controls, advanced. Uh, we're on 37, so let's bring it up to 52. Uh, what are we voting on here? Main circuit, Crash Canyon. Oh, I'm down. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, Crash Canyon. It does feel weird not wearing the GoPro today. I will say, I'm looking down i'm like wow look at all my freedom i got today man it's crazy okay we're just gonna we're just gonna set the ready i'm not gonna get caught in that oh whoa what is it? i have a combine in front of me oh boy this is good okay that's why you don't look behind you at the start of the race or in cinematic modes <laughs> okay oh boy i'm only in 21st that's not bad P21. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at everybody. That guy just spawned in, thankfully. Damn, excuse me. Coming through. Oh shit. Oh my. Move, move. Oh, Wreckfest does such a great job at making the game just flow, even with all the destruction. Jeez. Oh my god, man. This is wild. We also, like I said, bumped it up to 50% on the force feedback. Uh-huh. This guy's going backwards, looks like. Yep. A lot of power coming from the wheel, though. Very impressed with the T248 right now. It's giving me a run for my money. Oh! Flip him! Oh, shit. Oh, my. Oh, whoa. Little leg. Okay. We're in that... We're in that pasta spin. Whew. Oh, no. Now, currently at the time of this going out, uh, Formula One, man. We're at the Belgium Grand Prix Spa. Oh! Oh, no! Banger rate. Okay, let's go Big Valley Speedway, I think. Wow, Dirt Devil Stadium. 11 votes. Okay, I guess we're going there. I need a new car ASAP, because that thing is slow. We are in the damn car now. I don't... Oh, what?! He's on my car now! Oh my goodness! That was crazy! This guy came in my window! Oh shit, oh shit, I hate this corner. Hate this corner! Okay. Can't see basically anything behind me. Where is he? Batman? Whoa. Oh shit. Oh, it's a Rexy. Oh, that's a hard hit. Oh, we just jumped over that man, I think. 17 seconds left. So we can bring it home. Excuse me. Can't see a damn thing. Six. I don't think I'm making this. Three, come on, we're right here, man. Oh, no. Maybe we rolled over the line. Does that count? Yeah, so currently my garage is not looking the greatest since last episode that we did this, but uh, today wasn't about the garage. It was about the wheel and testing this out. And first impressions with this, right, it is a very strong wheel for what this is. I'm actually uh, very surprised. So I'm going to try to run this car again, considering we didn't have the greatest of starts on there. Uh, but on the mode, though, you have force feedback, you have rotation, pedals it'll if you're inverting it or if you're floor mounting it it also shows the temperature which is uh pumping out to a 39 degrees celsius at the moment and then you can also switch it about to it shows your base version as well um as your firmware and all that good stuff too so i think it looks great i honestly do the hand where you mount your hands is really ergonomic i feel like and this kind of rubber that's on the top gives you a good kind of um cushion if you will on on your grips of your hand i don't know how to explain it but it feels it actually feels nice we're gonna stick in uh cockpit view here for this let's see how bad this goes here oh boy okay oh shit seeing that coming a mile away oh they're gonna go out of this view here because that is just it's asking for some issues What's going on right now? Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Right in the way. 
Love to see it. Oh, big contact up there. Oh, this guy just went right in front of the road. A little bit easy on the brakes. Just squish, yeah. I love how there's no real boundaries, right? You can just throw it out to the day outside if you want. What is this? Where, where's everyone going? Okay. Oh no. Yes, thank you. That guy ate that for me. What? That guy just pulled a Dominic Toretto? Huge position gains out here. Oh boy. Don't want to lock him. Please don't hit me, please don't hit me, please don't hit me. Oh, they wanted to. You know they wanted to back there. Come on, come on. Everyone keeps cutting. Oh, he two wheeled. He did not roll it, but he went right into the damn pit area, it looks like. Oh shit. Come on. Top 10 so far. Definitely different than the load cells. Because they do have the spring capability now instead of the actual magnetic feel, I do believe, is what that is. Oh shit. Oh! No! <laughs> P15 after all that. Could have been worse. We're going to drip this right into the damn dirt. And, yeah. I do like the clicks on the damn shifter, though, man. They're super satisfying. Because they're enough that you can actually hear them a little bit, even when you have your headset on fully cupped. And it just gives you that kind of immersion feel, I feel like. Just having that physical click. Oh, no. Jeez. You may not pass. He passed. Now, now I have to take you out. Or you just take yourself out. This is your fourth corner. It's your fourth time around this corner. You can't get it right? Oh! Hey! Oh! Oh! Yes! Thank you! No. No, Batman. I, I can't. I can't. I can't let you do it, buddy. I can't let you do it, buddy. Oh! <laughs> Shit! That's karma. If you guys have not played Wreckfest yet, definitely go ahead and take a look. So, of course, make sure you guys bookmark Thrustmaster's page for the release for the pre-orders on the brand new Thrustmaster T248. Huge thanks for watching today. Um, this has been a lot of fun paired up with the T3PM pedals out here. And, uh, right, we got the Next Level Racing Rig holding us together. The BenQ monitor, like I said. Huge thank you to Thrustmaster, though, for sponsoring today's episode. Make sure you guys go ahead and check out the links down below for this T248. If, or if you're thinking about your first wheel, uh, this was really good, man. Really enjoyed this. Gave you a really nice sensation of force feedback and the pull. Um, and, you know, for what this was as an entry level wheel, I'm very impressed, man. This is, of course, if you have not already subscribed with post notifications, turn them on for all future content on the channel. Now, what game do you want to see played next with this wheel, man? Let me know in the comment section down below. Huge thanks for watching today. Might as well start off one more race, man. Let's see how we do in turn one. Last race of the day. Huge thanks for watching today. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow on the channel, man. I'm out. Peace.